First of all, I want to thank everybody for coming here. Uh, this has started in 2005 with Governor Rell's leadership and her foresight to see that we needed in Connecticut to look at this project independently and report our findings to those who will listen and to those even who will not listen. And we did that. And I want to thank Governor Rell. I want to thank the Attorney General. Whenever we had issues concerning uh, possible technical difficulties or engineering principles or guidelines in law, we sought his advice. His office door was always open to us. I want to thank the folks at um, the Fund for the Environment and Protection of Long Island Sound for all that they've did, Leah, everything that you've done for us is just, just terrific. Most of all, I got to thank my task force. What a great group of individuals. We put out two reports and then we also did a PowerPoint that ended up really being a, a report and we sent that to New York. They got back to us. They read it. They took a look at it. We were talking to them as late as a couple of days ago on some of the things. So I know that we had an impact, but the people of that task force just did an exceptional, an exceptional job. And this is a new beginning. This is an absolute new beginning. Connecticut and New York are a power. And we're powered to protect our common boundary, which is the Long Island Sound. This beautiful resource should never, ever, be attacked again like it was with this application. And what we've shown is we can beat the federal government and we could take what's ours and protect it as long as we work together. And if this isn't a call out that we need to work together, nothing is. And the words that the Attorney General just said about Governor Patterson and the fact that Governor Rell has, has this open dialogue with Governor Patterson is going to go a long way to ensuring that on both sides of the pond, we have a united effort to protect the Long Island Sound, a united effort to deal with our issues of energy and fuel needs, and we can do that now that we understand that unless we do it, others will try to force it down our throats. So I want to thank everybody for coming here, and I look forward to a new beginning. Thank you.